What's essential in life looks different to everybody. But for a choir in St. Paul, it's making music. I have been pondering the question, is it worth it, for months and months and months. And the more I pondered it, the more I realized we have to sing. I mean, we are essential. There's so many emotions and so much turbulence in our world that sometimes the only thing that can get to that is music. But attempting to make music during a pandemic is a path that few have trod. We have one of the safest environments for singing and wind playing anywhere. And to achieve that status, we went into the chapel and measured six feet radius, and so that there are exactly 54 seats in that chapel. The windows are open. And if that wasn't enough, there are six state-of-the-art air sanitization units. That's enough to basically sanitize an entire room. Every two or three minutes, the entire volume of air in the room is cleaned. But why go to all that trouble to make music? All of that music is really, really designed to help people process what they're going through right now. And that's why I said to them a few weeks ago, I said, I, I've pondered the idea of whether we're essential or not. And I think we are more essential than ever because who else in a COVID era pandemic is gonna speak that kind of truth? Who else is going to take the words of scripture and the words of, of theological poetry and hymns and relay it to people. That's why we need to sing. And that's why this concert is called How Can We Keep From Singing? Just try to stop us. You can't. From Eagle 7 News, I'm Scott Kruger.